The city's new top cop in town and talking about how he plans to change the Pittsburgh Police Bureau. Thanks for joining us at 6. I'm Ken Rice. And I'm Susan Copeland. Incoming Police Chief Cameron McClay made some bold statements about how things are now going to be different in the way officers police Pittsburgh. Harold Hayes joins us live with more tonight. Harold. Well, Cameron McClay says within the police bureau, there are people who are suffering. He says that's not fair. And he also says there's the distrust of police in some communities, which he says isn't right. So he's going to try to fix both. He comes in as an outsider, which is unusual. The advantage, he says, is being able to see things others may not. The disadvantage, he says, is the possibility of not being trusted. Will he clean house? Not before studying the landscape, he says. He'll look at surveys from police and surveys from the community. Just like a, a physician examines before they prescribe, similarly, I'm going to have to get my feet on the ground. I'm going to have to talk to everybody. And he says he will resurrect the Pittsburgh Initiative to Reduce Crime, or PERC. It's supposed to coordinate police, social services, and the community to stop homicides, but has floundered recently. It's my intention that we are going to reinstitute and implement PERC because the shootings, the violence in our neighborhoods has absolutely got to stop. The methodology behind PERC is extremely well researched. It works consistently everywhere it's been faithfully implemented. Meantime, the Allegheny County District Attorney's already disagreed openly with the public safety director and the mayor over law enforcement issues. Now that the chief is in place, he says he'll eventually ask to meet with him. You need a chief of police. If you don't follow policies and procedures, someone's got to kick you in the butt and say, hey, you know what, there are problems. You're creating problems unnecessarily. There should be discipline. So, I mean, that, that's, there's a chain of command, an aspect, a very important aspect of a chain of command that wasn't there until this gentleman was retained. Meantime, McClay says he hopes to make his home in Squirrel Hill. Downtown Harold Hayes, KDKA TV News.